This is the JTV News Update. I am Sean Rose. Her Majesty's prison inmate Andrew Angus Penn has been charged with escaping lawful custody after escaping from the prison compound that Balsam got on Saturday afternoon, April 6. Following a report by prison officials of an escaped prisoner around 4 p.m. Saturday, RVIPF task force along with East End police and prison officers began an intensive foot and mobile search in the bushy area surrounding the prison. Penn was apprehended about an hour later walking along the main road near the prison farm. He was then arrested and transported to the East End Police Station and formally charged. Police say investigations are ongoing. Minister for Education and Culture Honorable Myron Walwyn says the time is right to introduce school boards as part of efforts to improve the various aspects of the management functions of the educational institutions in the territory. The minister says the initiative will begin with a pilot program in select schools across the territory. At this juncture in our history, where our population has grown significantly, the territory has advanced in many ways. I believe that it is now necessary to appoint school boards and have more participation from our community and retired education professionals in the management of our schools. Mr. Speaker, I'm cognizant of the fact that several things will have to change. The, th the way we do things presently will have to change and change is not always easy. But Madam Speaker, change we must. The duties of a management board are clearly outlined in the Act, and the board will, among other things, have general oversight of the running of the school. It will, Madam Speaker, examine and investigate student progress, discipline of students, ensure school records are kept, establish a procedure for resolving disputes, approve school plans, and establish policies for the administration, management, and operation of the school. Madam Speaker, I think the time is right for us to begin this process, and so I've asked the Acting Chief Education Officer and her staff to begin looking at the formation of school boards for the following schools. Altea Scatliff Primary School, Brigada Flax Educational Center, one board to serve both divisions, Florida Creek Educational Center, Just Van Dyke Schools, and the Elmo Stout High School. This directive was given after a consultative meeting was held with the principals of the aforementioned schools the British Virgin Islands Tourist Board will host BVI Marketplace on Thursday, April 11 at Maria's by the Sea. The day-long event will bring attendees from throughout the tourism industry together with representatives from various local associations, airlines and overseas agencies for face-to-face -face meetings and network opportunities. The Tourist Board has issued an invitation to the public to attend the evening session for the launch and celebration of the BVI staycation and summer packages from 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. For the JTV News Update, I am Sean Rose.